Hey guys, Sandy here, and I wanted to ask you guys a question. And that question is, should I apply for YouTube partnership? Um, I know I have applied for it in the past, but during those times I got rejected due to either a low amount of subscribers or through, or uh, because I had copyrighted material on my uh, account. So if I were to seriously apply for YouTube partnership, I would have to remove all my copyrighted content that they have tagged. And uh, <clears throat> if that were to happen, I will move all that stuff to my secondary channel, which is uh, youtube.com slash theandysan. So it won't be completely gone, but uh, it will be off of my main channel, and I'll just have to put all my, keep all my stuff on my secondary channel. So, yeah. <laughs> um, another thing is uh, the whole subscriber issue. Um, most people would recommend to have at least a thousand subscribers before applying for partnership, but I know that's not so much the case anymore. YouTube is a little more lenient towards people with lower subscriber counts. It's mostly views for specific videos and things like that, which I think I'll be able to match up to their standards, I hope. <laughs> but uh, another thing that's been kind of holding me back with the whole partnership program is, uh, well, a lot of my newer viewers may not know this, but some of my older ones probably do. But uh, several years back, I'm thinking probably around 2007, 2008, I don't remember exactly, but around that time, um, I, uh, <clears throat> excuse me. I applied for the AdSense program, and I basically just tried to game the system, you know, tried getting extra clicks and things like that, but uh, Google caught on pretty quick, and they banned my account, so I haven't been able to reinstate it, and I was still able to use my uh, AdWords account for several campaigns just to try some stuff out. And I tried logging back into it several weeks ago. Actually, I think it was several months ago, to be honest. And uh, they automatically banned my AdWords account because uh, I guess the reasoning was uh, one of my ads that I was experimenting with was uh, violated their standards or something, but I was in the middle of editing it. So that way it will follow their standards, but they somehow auto-banned me. I don't get it. So I'm not even able to use AdWords anymore. So if I were to become YouTube partner, um, I don't know if I'll be able to make any actual revenue off of it. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> um, if I do become partner, I'll try to get the ban on my AdSense account lifted. But from what I've you know seen and what I've been told, that's not very likely going to happen. So... I will try, but, you know, don't know if it's going to happen. But uh, even if I don't get my AdSense account unbanned and stuff, uh, one of the, a lot of the benefits that partners have uh, that I look forward to are uh, being able to have a customized subscription button, uh, being able to customize your YouTube page a bit more, and uh, having higher priority uh in search results if you're a partner. That's one of the uh, hidden benefits from uh, what I've been told. So uh, definitely, definitely want to do that. And uh, yeah, so once again, I'm torn between uh, actually applying for partnership or just staying the course. Um, I do know that I want to progress my channel to the next level. And you know, I've, I've been on YouTube for over five years now. So, you know, I have a definite back catalog of videos and stuff that still get a lot of views. And uh, applying for partnership and getting partnership would definitely be, you know, a big step in uh, progressing my channel. But there's also a lot of rules and stuff to go along with it. You know, if I were to become partner for my main channel, I can't, uh, I can't have copyrighted material and stuff like that. But like I said, I do I have found ways to uh get around that situation, but yeah, that's uh <laughs> I know I kind of kind of uh rambled, but that's the basic gist that I wanted to get across to you guys. So, I look forward to your comments below uh, as far as whether I should or should not apply for YouTube partnership. 
And yeah, that's pretty much all I got to say. So yeah, this is the Andy Song, signing off for now. Thank you guys for tuning in to this uh, rambly mobile video. And for liking, commenting, subscribing, sending a few friends to the party. And like I said, I look forward to your responses in the comments below. Uh, definitely uh, hit me up with personal messages if uh, you have a little more detail with the whole partnership program. You know, you can send me comments, messages, likes, stuff like that. And as always, we'll see you guys next time. Later.